Uh, here? Where's the door? There it is. <laughs> All right. Huh. Okay, cool. This is good. So we've now explored the green section. They're going well, I'm glad to hear it, man. That's awesome. Uh... All right. Go back to the same spot up here, because we want to go down from here. Dang, so close, so close. All right. Um, you ended up doing Chrono Cross, right, Xenos? Is that right? I need to play Chrono Cross again. I literally haven't played it in 20 years. 20 years. This is my favorite area to get some crazy levels and death blows. Yeah, it seems like a good spot for it. Seems like a very good spot for it. And good money, too. Um, yeah. Yeah, I've, I've been getting a lot of levels. That's for sure. I don't like having to use this little girl, though. She's pretty trash. Although, I guess her, um, her ether powers are pretty good. But she's slow. She's weak defensively. She attacks, her attacks are so slow. Apparently, she can't learn death blows. Or just doesn't have any death blows. A Nemo wave! Fantastic. All right. Um, wow, Ellie was trapped back there for a little while. That was weird. Let's go. Dude, it's a long way down. It's a really long way down. Holy cow. Jeesh. Jeesh. I always grind here once I get seven AP. Chrono Cross. So Sam hadn't played in almost 20 years after getting 100%. Yeah, like, I haven't played it since it came out. Like, I got it when it came out and and played it, and I haven't played it since. Um, Ellie needs Omega Sol. All right. Dude, the money is pouring in, man. Okay, let's look at the map. Yeah. Yeah, so we follow this. We want to bear down when we can. Right here. Alright. Yup, 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 yup. <laughs> And then Ellie, you're gonna do a similar thing. Hmm, not ideal, but it's good enough. Good enough that we can get the kill with Robo Poncho. Miss again, aww. All right, time for Robo Poncho. Bam. All right, good stuff. You're not dead? Well, let's kill him fast. Very good. Maria's pretty bad for on-foot combat. Her gear isn't great, but can take some damage. Yeah, it's, it has an awful lot of health. Terra Ghost? Dude, we're learning stuff. I love how she calls her gear for special moves. Yeah, I think it's hilarious that her gear can come into these air shafts or whatever they are. Um, okay, status, skills. Dude, Ellie's doing great. She's just got XX left. Nice. Cool. All right. Awesome. Um, there's probably treasure at the end of this hall. Yep. The Whiplasher. That's got to be a weapon for... Um, for Bart. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right, glad to have it. Glad to have it. Let's go. All right. Now, we don't... We want to go down. I think. I think we want to go down. 
I was watching some speedruns this past week and saw them using Maria and Billy on the final boss and just mowing him down, yeah? Yeah, I mean, like, I imagine they can output lots of damage. I just... I don't really like Billy as a character. I think he's lame. I think he's lame. And, like, the gun thing is weird. I don't like that he has to use ammo. You know? Like, of course that makes him more powerful because you have to use items, but, like... It's a regular attack. It should just be a regular attack. All right, Forbidden. Uh, yes. Very good. Ellie. Um, XX. Good stuff. And then Robo Poncho. Pretty certain they had ether and ether doubler. Just use the special options. Yeah. Oh. Oh. Is, is the last fight in gears? Did neither of them die? This is bad. This is really bad. Super bad. Oh no. Faye and Ellie can both live here, I think. Oh my god. don't want to die here. We've made so much money. Is there... You would try to get Faye up? I want to get her up because she's got multi-attacks. I mean, if she can get a turn, we're good. God. Okay, that was really scary. Did her, like, Thermo Largo... She's learning all the hit-all elemental abilities, I guess. What'd we get? Econometer. Yeah, that was a close one. Um... Does Econometer make her stuff cheaper? Have ZP uses in battle. Yeah. Yeah. Now we'll just use Robo Kiko every time. I'm glad we came down here. That's great. Okay. I would love a save point after that experience. A save point would be really, really nice. Okay. Whoa. Oh, we're good. We're good. We want to continue to the north. Hey, it's moving? Uh-oh. <laughs> Uh-oh. Oh, it's just these guys. I've been everywhere else, Jarek. North is the way I want to go. I've covered all the territory in this place. At least according to the map I have. Alright, this is fine. I like it when they attack one person, so we only have to use one Omega Sol. I'm gonna have to buy a bunch more. I'm gonna have to buy a bunch more Omega Sols, it looks like. Alright, that's fine. We've made so much money down here. <laughs> that won't be a problem. Uh, 
All right, finish him. Doo, 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 doo. Go south and that's where I just was. I just got the Econo meter. The Econo meter. Why is it on equip every time? Okay. Uh, Omega Sol right here. And, um... Mapo. Okay. There's no reason to go into the staircase, I think. Because it just goes back to the blue area. Yeah. I think we're good. I think we're good. These obstacles are the worst. Like, being... Uh, whatever. It doesn't matter. But, like, the fact that you can get into random encounters when you're not actually moving... I, lo I love it and I hate it. You know? I love it and I hate it. Um, okay. Face still hasn't learned tri uh, Triangle Square X. Ellie still needs XX. So that's good damage. And then, uh, Maria here will be able to Robo Poncho and kill him. Robo Poncho. Dude, this is a, g a very good cost to ether here. <laughs> like, uh, approximately 500 damage to everything for almost, for three ether. Like, that's so good. All right. Yumpo. Yumpo. Take me down. Oh, yeah. All right. Yeah, it only cost five before, but for three, like, that's a great deal. And four for Robo Kiko? Does the economy ether take away the bonus of the ether doubler? I don't know if I ever tried it. We could try it. We just got a save point. Let's try it. Uh, we'll just drop a save here. We don't need to use a tent or anything. I would imagine that the economy ether keeps the bonus, but makes everything cost, um, regular amount. Yeah, that's what I would assume. That's what I would assume. All right. No, I blew it. I blew it. All right, we gotta get rid of these guys ASAP. Um, I can't believe how badly they wrecked us last time. All right. Random battle blew it for me. Yeah, indeed, indeed. Uh, attack, XX. And Robo Kiko. Yeah, I'm not taking any risks with these guys anymore. They're getting Robo Kicked every time. Every time. All right. Another gold nugget, dude. We're making so much money down here. Okay. Um, Faye, Faye, please, thank you. Oh my god. How's my Mario Odyssey been going? Xenos, I actually, I completed the regular game. <laughs> it took about three days uh, to, to beat Bowser and do a little bit of the post-game content. Um, but I loved it, man. It was so fun. Was so fun. The whole thing will go up on YouTube pretty soon. Um, yeah, it was great. It's great. I'm gonna play Golf Story next. Um, and there's still plenty for me to do on Mario Odyssey, of course. Like, I'm not done with the game, but I don't want to do 100% playthrough recorded. Like, the main game, I don't, I don't feel like the main game felt short. I don't feel like it felt short 
shorter than any other 3D Mario. You know? Like, it felt about the same. It just... You weren't as forced to pick up the unnecessary stars slash moons or whatever. Um... What? What was that? Well, how did I not make that jump? Um, yeah, it feels like it, it felt kind of ordinary for a Mario game for me. Not like gameplay wise, but um, game length. It felt pretty standard to me. Um, and yeah, with all the extra stuff to do, I think maybe they could have fit in. I don't know. Good amount of worlds. It was a really great new game. Yeah, I think there the amount of worlds was fine. I I love the post game content. The post game content in the Mushroom Kingdom is awesome. It's so good. I'm I'm really satisfied with it. It was it was worth every penny, man. Great game. Great game. We'll play again. We'll play more as well. Like, just great. Just a great game. I had fun. The only thing that I took issue with was the fact that, um, on a non-pro controller, you couldn't, you couldn't do all the moves. That bothers me. Because there are buttons that are going unused, um, on the controller, so you should be able to do everything. These random encounters are crazy, dude! Wow. Alright. Why am I seeing how much HP they have? What's going on with that? That didn't happen in the past. Alright. We'll just use another tent. <laughs> it's fine. Yeah, I'm actually kind of glad we didn't bring Satan along. Um, because he just, he doesn't need the, uh... He doesn't need the death blow training that we're all getting down here. It's nice. Isn't that an item that Maria has equipped? No? Oh, there was something I wanted to have a look at here. I saw an item, like I have an item and it said everybody could use it. But I don't see it anywhere. Um, and we can't just look at stuff, can we? No. Yeah, I found an item. Power crisis. As HP goes down, attack goes up. I see. I see. Yamato Belt is really good. Indeed. Indeed. Um. I just don't know. I don't know who I'm going to give it to. Like. I guess Maria could use it, but. Uh, we'll just use a tent. Drop another save. And hopefully make it over this again. Is Power Crisis great? It seems like it would be really good for somebody like Faye. Or Satan, who has so many HP. Alright. What? One HP Faye with Power Crisis? I'll bet. These random encounters with jumping puzzles do not mix. I'm not happy with it. I'm very unhappy with it, in fact. Like... The fact that a random encounter can prevent you from jumping while you're sliding down the thing, like, that's awful. Truly awful. At least reward me with a gold nugget for this. And don't make me fight, like, a, a million of you in a row trying to get up the freaking ladder again. As well, please. If you could make that happen, that would be very helpful. Alright, level up for Faye. That was a lot of HP. It's one of my biggest complaints in this. Yeah. Yeah. 
That's super sucky. Probably going to have to go and use another tent. We'll go ahead and drop another save as well <laughs> while we do it. Yep, we're gonna we're gonna want to use a tent. It's fine. It's fine. No, no rando pause. Yeah, the encounter rate here is really bad. Training XX will also help train Triangle 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 X for Faye. Faye already has Triangle 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 X. He just doesn't have um. He doesn't have Triangle Square X yet. No, Faye is missing a few, but he needs he needs Triangle Square X, Square Triangle X, and XX currently. All right. Use another tent. Drop another save. And let's see if we can make it over this time. I have my doubts. I mean, since this is a good place to, like, level up and grind, though, I guess I can't really complain about the encounter rate. It's kind of nice that the encounter rate is so high. All right. Yeah. Triangle square, triangle square should boost his rate gain. Triangle square, triangle square. Okay. Okay. And Ellie only needs XX. She actually learned them faster than Faye did since we were without him for so long. It's based on the digit the specific hit lands on. It's weird. I'm not going to pretend to understand it. <laughs> I'm not going to do that. All right. Water bottle. Give me a drink. Who needs death blows when you've got Robo Kiko? Anyway, not me. Not this guy. Gold bullion this time. Nice. That's worth more than gold nuggets, I think. Okay. Oh my god. Alright. Alright. <laughs> These guys, let's go. Ba -da 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 -ba -ba -ba. I spent too much time reading up on it because I had a few death blows I couldn't get past 80%. Yeah, yeah, if I was if I was planning on like 100%ing, I would probably do that reading too. I remember the first time I, I started playing this game, which was probably like six or seven years ago, um, I looked at it a little bit and I did some death blow training as well with Bart and Faye. Excuse me. When they first end up underground in the cave where Balthazar is. I did a little bit of death blow training, but I didn't really get very far past that part in the end. I'm glad I started over. I'm glad I'm 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 really playing through this game now though. It makes me really happy. I like this game a lot. It's quite good. Oh my god. We made it. Made it. Can slash should I drop down there? No, I cannot. All right. Ooh, this is fun. All right, this isn't a jumping puzzle. I can I can much I can get much more behind. All right, here we go. Haya! Good stuff. Good stuff. Cool. I hope that there's no treasure down there, because I am not doing that again. Why would I turn it around, you say? No one knows. Alright. Down we go. No pauses. Yes. Yes, yes, yes. All right. 
is there a map in here? No, no maps. Ba -da -ba -ba -da -ba -ba. We changed the direction just in case someone's following me. Good. Yes. Indeed, Shadow Dragon. Thank you for rationalizing my behavior. <laughs> Much appreciated. Okay. And Ellie. Oh, nope. Nope, nope, nope. There we go. Now Ellie can get her XX on. Alright. One good hit is good enough. Um, Robo Kiko. Ba -da. La -da. Ba -ba. Dude, with Ether Doubler, she'd do a lot of damage, wouldn't she? She'd do like a real lot of damage. Yay! Tenbu and Sting Kick. Very nice. Alright. Um, status. Skills. Triangle Square X. So now he's got Square Triangle X and XX. That's fine. Cool. I like it. We want to go over this. Downstairsies. Very good. Dude, we're gonna have so much money. We're gonna be able to upgrade everybody's gears so much. It's gonna be great. Right here, yes. Okay. Pretty linear at this point. I don't mind. I don't mind. I like the music. Oh boy. It's Shinra Headquarters all over again. My goodness. My goodness. All right. Ba -da -ba -ba -da -ba -ba. All right, good stuff. Now, Faye. Um, Square Triangle X is next. Ellie, I'd kind of like to see what your new one looks like, so let's check it out. Sting Kicka! Awesome. Very cool. Very cool. Um... We're still gonna use Robo Kick here. Just to make sure it dies. These guys do a lot of damage when they're alone. Robo Kick -o! Go! Alright. Light Alloy. I'll take it. <laughs> Who knows what that does? Not me. Ooh, another save point. Oh, yes. Let me over. All right. Time for another tent. And another save. I'm using a lot of tents, and I, it makes me really happy, actually, that I'm using a lot of tents. I have no idea where that Spyro the Dragon save came from. I don't think I've ever owned a Spyro the Dragon game. Never played one. Once we get through that manhole, we'll be able to enter the hangar. All right. Manhole. All right, into the hangar. Can finally fight somebody, somebody real, someone legit. All right, are there enemies in here? We gotta go this way, right? Yes. Aha! The hangar. We've arrived. Where's the intruder? Mm, it's you again. You pests aren't making my job any easier. Who are you? Id? 
No. <laughs> I can't recognize it. There's so many characters in this game. Dominia, is that you? Never thought I'd come across Sieb Sane in my place of escape. I'll take Sieb Sane. Originally, this belonged to us, Solaris. Dominia, I can't let you have that gear. Fool. Not even knowing this gear is the point of contact between us. Huh. That child. Hey, you. Are you the daughter of Nikolai? Undoubtedly, I am the daughter of Nikolai, Maria Balthazar. What about it? I see. So you're his beloved daughter to whom he offered himself to undertake that difficult task. Hey, young girl, want to hear an interesting story? Let's see. How about the cursed secret of Zeebzane? What do you mean? What do I mean? You'll understand it when you hear the story. Mm, she's going to talk about how awful, her, her, how whiny her dad was as she murdered him to death. I'm sure. For the past several decades, our scientists have put so much effort into the research to create evolved gears. Regardless of how great a pilot one is, as long as it is human, there will always exist a time lag and human error when interfacing with the machine. That's when your father, Nikolai, was targeted. He was a genius in the field of cranial nerve mechanisms. They made Nikolai search for a way for humans to go beyond humans by merging humans and machines. In other words, they were trying to create a new life, an ultimate living weapon, by connecting a living human brain to a gear directly. It would have stayed as a mere fantasy without Nikolai, but that genius made the fantasy come true. That's a lie. My father wouldn't do such a horrible thing. I don't lie, Maria. This is the truth. Your splendid father succeeded in fusing man and machine, and he opened the gates to hell for the lambs. As a matter of fact, various data and components obtained from the war in Ignis and the battling in Kislev were used as experimental materials. That is how the special humanoid mutants Vels were born. Vels created in Solaris were tested on the surface. Only the Vels that passed the test were dismantled, restructured, and reborn. They became the gear's central control circuit and became part of the machine. It's all the result of your father's great research. Zeebsain is the prototype of a man-machine fusion gear. In other words, Zeebsain was completed at the cost of innumerable land dwellers' lives. And in the nerve circuit of Zeebsain lies... Don't you think you've said enough, Domitia? Who is it? Oh, nice. It's Cowboy. Why are women so gossipy? They jabber about things they shouldn't be talking about. Hopeless. Josiah, you... What are you doing in Shavat? At one point, weren't you considered to be the next Gebler Commander-in-Chief? Don't get so excited. <laughs> I think you've played with enough fire for today. Just go home. Maria is the only one who can operate Zeb Zane. You should be well aware of that. Hm, fools, don't get so cocky. The party's just begun. But I guess it's alright. My mission is complete. All that's left is... Maria, I'm afraid I must go now. Enjoy your party. <laughs> oh, Jesse shows up just hanging from some pole on the ceiling for no reason. Wait, Dominia. Is Jesse gone now? Father. Hey, Maria, don't mind what she told you. This is. All right. What are you, what's, what's going on, Jesse? Looks like our guests have arrived. Let's go upstairs. Yggdrasil's also accommodated in the dock. I'm sure the other guys are making a fuss over it. I have an ominous premonition. I doubt it, but they could have. They could have what, Jesse? They could have what? No, Zeebzane. Don't do anything crazy. Just be nice. Zeebzane. Flashback? No. Flash forward. The Solaris gear units are on a high speed interception course with Shavat. <laughs> 
it would be reasonable to believe that their main targets are going to be the four gate generators. They're probably planning on finishing us off since Dominia's demolition has weakened the gate output. We have scrambled our interceptor units, but I do not know how they will fare. The people of Shabbat are not accustomed to gear tactics. I want to avoid unnecessary sacrifices if at all possible. Yeah, I know, Doc. We'll go. We're already involved, and we can't just stand by and watch these people die. Faye. I don't like the idea of working for free, but I don't like the idea of turning tail and running from them even more. Let's do it. Doesn't matter who they are, I'll take them all down in my Zeke the gear. <laughs> yes. Yes, we'll do what we can to protect the people here. Since the day I met you all, there's been nothing but trouble. But I've come this far with you all. I guess there's no point in bitching about it. I'll show them what happens when they tick the great Rico off. I'll go too. The enemy was able to get in because they let the Yggdrasil in. We can't allow the people of this country to be in danger because of us. Yeah. Right on. Go for it, youngins. We're dependent on you. Especially since my life also depends on it. I have no intentions of kicking the bucket here. Shut up. Dad, could you not say anything? Alright, alright, I know. Why can't you be more nicer? <laughs> Why can't you be more nicer? Alright, Collie Chew's gonna chew help chew. Chew, chew, chew. Going to help? Collie Chew, what are you doing here? Well, in all the bustle, she somehow tagged along. What am I gonna do? This isn't a game. It's dangerous, so go back to the, to the Yggdrasil, okay, Kali Chu? Be a good girl. Be a good girl, Kali Chu. Uh, um, Kali Chu's not a good girl. I'm in that dangerous age right now. And Kali Chu can help Chu. I'm going with all of Chu, yeah, yeah? All right, Chu. All right. Don't come crying to me when things get out of hand. So they call you Kali Chu also. Many of your friends live in this city. You want to go meet them later? R really? They're all here? Yay! I finally found them. Kali Chu's friends. They're here. Oh, Kali Chu. Now let's put everything into it. Everyone, we have to give our best shot. Oh my God. Here's the breakdown of the enemy gear units. If I exp if I, as I have explained before, four separate units are each headed for their respective generators. From the information collected in Shavat, we have a good idea of the capabilities and composition of the gear units. However, there is one giant gear that they are holding back that we have no information about. An unidentified giant gear. Can't be. Allow me to put it on screen. Okay. Go ahead. Go on. Zoom! It's, uh, sure is red. This is... Octane? Oh. What's with that creepy gear? You know anything, Maria? Octane? It's the second gear my father designed. Zeepsane's sister gear. But Octane wasn't completed. Other than Zeepsane, father didn't make any more. He was supposed to have burned the plans. So why... People of Shabbat, hear me. That voice, no, father. Oh, it's Nikolai. I'd heard some interesting rats had run into there. Just in time to test out Oxane. I can take you and Shabbat out all at once. Hello, little rats, come on out. Come on, my cute little guinea pigs. Why that? Why is father? Oh, man. Calm down, Maria. It doesn't mean that Dr. Nikolai is inside. But, but, Father's voice. Maria, get a hold of yourself. You intend to lose even before you fight against the very people who made you suffer. But it's my deode. Oh no, oh no. Well, that is fine. Let us consider our next move. We must repulse the gear forces and protect the generator. To do that, let us split into four teams and intercept the enemy. The four of us will attack independently and defend each generator to the death. The other two wait here. It is dangerous, but we cannot turn back now. If even one generator falls, it is a defeat for us. 
Maria, you wait here. Please, Maria. Okay, uh, I understand. Next, the formation of the enemy gear forces. At Generator 1, there are two small gears and a complement of Solaris troops. If you do not hit them fast and hard, you will get bogged down in a firefight. At Generator 2, there are three White Knights. They're very fast and maneuverable. At Generator 3, there is a large gear and a White Knight. Be careful. The large gear has some kind of special attack. At Generator 4, there is a large gear and a White Knight. The large gear seems to be a power gear. Dude! This is complicated. This is complex. Alright, so who was at Generator 1? Two small gears and Solaris troops. We need to hit them fast and hard. Um, so somebody with AoE would be good for that. I mean, Ellie's gonna win whoever we put her with. Ellie for Generator 1? Yeah, that makes sense. And I'm gonna put Ellie with, uh, oh, for Generator 2. All right, Generator 2 is three white knights. I could just do Fey Or Satan. They'd both probably kick their butts. Um... Wait. Can Ellie just go to all of them? <laughs> uh... Generator 2 is three white knights. Billy could be okay. Could use his cannon attack. Get rid of one quick. Let's do Billy. Who will go to generator 3? Who is at generator 3? Special attack gear and one white knight. Alright. We're gonna have Faye go to 3. And Satan go to 4. Understood. The target assignments are... Generator 1, Ellie. Generator 2, Billy. Generator 3, Fey. Generator 4, Satan. Are these assignments okay? Um, yeah. Let's go. Please hurry and get the preparations for the battle in order. Now, is this alright? Uh, let me get ready. When you are ready, we will leave for the battle. Please hurry now. The enemy is almost there. Got it. We've come this far. We're not gonna get beaten now. Okay. Yeah, yeah, I figured we would want to save an upgrade. <laughs> um, people still need armor, so we'll do that. All right, we got to get out the front here. And you. All right, then, what shall it be? Gear parts, please. All right. Tune up. Armor. We got you the 3010. I'm okay with this. I think everybody's got their best. Oh no, they don't have their best frames? Yes. Okay, you have yours though. Alright, so do that. Yes, do that. Cool. 3010? 3010, okay. Zeke the gear. Ellie could just wipe out their whole assault force, I know. Yeah, good thing I had such a high encounter rate to get all this money, exactly. Um, okay, frames. 12,000, yes. Um, and you're gonna want fuel as well. And 3010, yes, let's go. All right, gear pants. Gear pants needs a new frame. Gear pants needs a new engine. All right, you're good. You're good then. Uh, but we need to refuel. Yes. Okay. You have the best frame possible, I'm sure. Your engine is crazy good. 
Uh, 50, 20? Oh my god. Alright, so you're good. I think everybody's good. Yeah. Yeah, we're looking strong. Oh, except Zeke the gear. I forget the name every time, and every time it makes me laugh. Gear Pants is so good, man. It's so good. Um, we're going to get you a new frame, for sure. And a new engine. And can we upgrade your armor? We can't quite afford to upgrade the armor, but we do have a lot of stuff we could sell. So, let's do it. Let's do it. Alright. And we want to buy more Omega Sol too, anyway. Items. Sell. Uh, items. We want to sell... The gold bullion and gold nuggets. It's a lot of money. Yeah. Yeah! Alright. And then we'll finish upgrading Zeke the gear, and we'll be good to go. We'll be good to go. Alright. Gear parts. Oh, uh, we do want to buy some items too, I forgot. Uh, okay. Derpa gear. Zeke the gear. Buy... Oh... We already have an S-Blood G-Whip. Um, Chrono Rod G, we should buy one of those. Yeah, slow effect? That's awesome. Um, but parts, most importantly. Oh, Veil Doubler? Oh, these are parts for, uh... Okay. Is power magic better? I think it is. Give me one of those. Dude, I should buy a few of these. Probably. Alright, first thing we gotta do is, uh, is tune you up. We need to get you your armor. Um, 3010. Yeah. Great. And now... We want to buy some parts. Um, yeah, spend it all on that. Spend it all on that. They're better than mo than those E circuits. That's what I figured. All right, so we can equip those on Billy as well, and of course on Ellie. Um, gear. So three power magics on Ellie. She's going to be devastating, dude. She's going to be devastating. And uh, you, you need power magic and power magic and also an E-circuit. E-circuit. Where is it? Actually, you know what? I'm going to give her frame HP 50 because she has so much HP. I think that's worthwhile. And then we also have the Chrono Rod G. Yes. She already had a 30 on. I know. I got rid of it and replaced it with a 50. Because I gave her two power magics as well. Um, okay. There's a bunch of stuff we can sell to the gear parts, too. Okay, this is fine. This is fine. Let's take our time. Let's do all this right. Gear parts, please. Sell. Uh, parts. We don't need extra armors. 
resp circuits, light, light armors. No. Uh, D circuit, B circuit, <laughs> ether armors, I'm selling them. Um, heavy alloy, what does that do? Extra armor plus five, no thanks. Alright, I'm fine with this. Weapons. We can get rid of all of these elemental rods, I think. Yeah, we don't need it. Dude, that's a lot of money. Alright, we want to keep that blood whip, though. Cool, we're good. We're good. Alright, and then we want to talk to this guy one more time. So we can do our items. Alright. More, uh... Omegasol. There we go. 20 of those is fine. <laughs> um, yeah, give me some more survival tents. Good enough. And... Add elements to attacks. Eh. Zetasol might be good. A little more of that. Restores EP to full. I can't afford 10. My goodness. No, don't cancel all purchases. Well, no, we don't want any of those. All right, we're good. We're good. If there's anything you need, please come by again. All right, let's go drop a save so we never have to deal with that again. And then we will head out for battle. Am I not in there? Sheesh. Sheesh. All right, I'm gonna take a little break before the next the next section. It's gonna be good. It's gonna be good. Um, so I'll be back shortly, everybody. For now, enjoy the dulcet tones of Rocco W, and I'll see you in ten or fifteen minutes. Be right back. <laughs> 